What's up, everybody? John Carlo and Subler here again, back with more One Piece. All right, listen, here's the deal, right? We're some fiends, okay? We're competitive card game <laughs> players. And yesterday you saw us uh, play the starter decks, right? But today they we... saw me win. They saw oh, yeah, me win. Good, great, good job. Awesome. You won a starter deck battle. Congratulations. <laughs> um, so we were, just, we were just talking. Okay, how do we actually, like make these better right so uh, obviously we don't have set one yet and again we're some damn fiends so we want to like we're, look we're not waiting we're gonna play until we get more so basically the idea is how do you take uh two starter decks and optimize them so that's probably gonna be the title of the video right optimizing your starter decks um yeah. because this is the only one piece we're probably going to be able to play for at least a couple months so we want the best decks possible so me and Subway, we're just going to talk about how to make luffy and Kaido the most optimized, you know, um, and uh, so we're going to start with Luffy. We're just going to talk about maybe, you know, what to cut, what to make more of and stuff like that. So first up, Sublet, what do you do you think it'd be easier to find cards to cut or find cards to add first? Um, I mean, this is a starter deck and you've got a lot of cards you can cut just yeah. off the gut, right? Like you've got extra cards that aren't that spectacular. You've got Vanillas. I think trying to look at the cards to cut is going to leave you with a 20 card deck. So mm. I think instead we look at stuff that should be a four of and then make make changes to the things that are obvious cuts. Okay. Like for example, Zoro versus uh, Nico Robin mm -hmm. is probably a better idea to shift that ratio a little bit. Right, absolutely. Because they have the same cost and then Zoro has an actual effect. So it's that's an easy one, right? The first thing that comes to mind for me is Gum Gum Pistol. It's currently a two of. I would like it to be a four of. Um, right, because so, yeah, tell the audience what Gum Gum Pistol does. Since this uh, is super not English. Yeah, uh, some it's like four mana KO is six cost or less trigger. You mm -hmm. can activate its effect. So if you hit it off a shield trigger for free, you kill a six cost or less. Yep. Um, this is very much akin to Digimon's Gaia Force. Uh, it's a little worse than their Gaia Force. Bandai has learned their lesson. But uh, yeah, anytime you flip a shield trigger that kills something, that saves your balls. <laughs> but this shit is like I don't know why it just reminds me of Sakuretsu armor from Yu-Gi-Oh like that's what uh, yeah, yeah. that's what this card reminds me of so okay Diablo Jambe in my mind kind of a mid card so it's uh, you activate it for one your opponent can't block whatever card you choose and then trigger um, it does the same shit right not a huge fan um, so immediately I would say cut Diablo Jambe for two additional copies of this guy uh of uh gum gum jet pistol that's my mind that's where i'm at here you know i completely agree and and what chesco just showed you is also good deck building habits he is replacing an extra card with an extra card he's keeping his deck's core uh heft if you will to to, to the same right like he yeah. if you drop your your combo power for your non-combo power your deck becomes heavier Heavier is a term that we used to use a lot in early Dragon Ball that kind of describes how easily your deck can combo out of your opponent trying to kill you. Mm -hmm. The more cards you have in your deck to combo with, the less likely you are to die. Um, but that also might decrease the power of your deck. So in, in, this, in this game, for example, extra cards you can't really combo with, they cost energy to do something. So if you're going to add more extra cards, you really want to take away more extra cards and kind of maintain that same number. Like here we see there are eight extra cards in the deck, and uh, that's probably a solid number in a 50-card deck, mm -hmm. in a one-eighth of the deck, or one-fifth of the deck, sorry. Um, so that's not too bad. You want to have a good amount of shield triggers so that one of them ends up in your life. And that's why eight is a great number, because you figure, all right, five cards off the deck go into life. So I'm giving myself a decent chance of one of them being a shield trigger, right? Yeah, so. yeah, yep. Mm -hmm. And, um, yeah, exactly. So speaking of cards that can combo and cards that can't, right? So, uh, for example, though, like we gave the Nico Robin and Zoro example. Yeah. Nico Robin can be comboed or countered in this game. So it might not be a clear-cut switch. However, looking at the overall deck list, a card that cannot be countered is this Tony Tony Chopper. It's a one-drop blocker. I, we, I mean, we're never fans of one drop blockers, right? We didn't like them in Dragon Ball. I don't think I liked them in this game. Again, we've had a little bit of limited experience. 
Um, but it, but like, I need all of my cards to be as high quality as they can because I don't draw cards. Luffy, not a single one of these cards says draw a card. So I need my cards to be as high quality as they can, right? So here in my mind, I'm thinking cut the four Tony Tony Choppers, give me two Zoros and give me two Luffy's. The same amount of combo power stays in the deck, but I get much more powerful cards. I, I do like that. I do like it. Um, you know, we don't really... We only have the two starter decks to go off of. Mm -hmm. And as far as removal goes, Kaido has removal, right? Yeah. Kaido has a 3 map that just mercs a dude. Yeah. Uh, Kaido is big, big guy, mercs a dude. Yep. And uh, one blocker isn't really enough when Kaido just drains you on resources. Like, your one blocker is yeah. not going to save you in a lot of cases. Yeah, I so, agree. From the knowledge we have, yeah. I agree. Removing Chomper is a good thing. I think maybe cut it to two though I, I think it is still a negate in a way right um mm -hmm. and that there's very little so so far in this game there's not as much interaction on the opponent's turn you've got combo you've got extra counters and you've got uh blockers that's all your interaction there's no counterplay um there's no like negate and attack kind of things so i don't yeah. know if sacrificing the blocker completely is necessarily a good call but i do agree with you that zoro needs to be at four and luffy needs to be at four and if there are no other options chopper is the clear cut cut that from the deck yeah yep and then the other i'd say like quote unquote worst card in the deck is probably karu a one cost 3k vanilla now um this one is pretty simple swap in my mind because uh brook is a two of <laughs> and exactly Thinking. Yeah, and so um, we're bumping Brooke up to not only that, but Brooke combos for 2k, which I mean, are the, are these our super combos? Are zero mana 2k combo card counters? Is that like a super combo? I don't know. Um, it feels like they start, right? Like, that's yeah. Um, so here are my options, right? I could cut four Karu, add two Brooke, and then add two Guard Point. That gives me two more shield triggers, and then Guard Point is a really good defensive card. I don't think it's that difficult to leave one man up. Um, so I could cut four Karu, go for four Brook, and four Guard Point. What do you think about that? That that eliminates these really like low impact one drops from my deck and gives me much higher quality of cards while also keeping the same amount of combo power. All right, you explained what Brook did by yeah. saying it was a 2K combo. Uh, what does Guard Point do? G give the audience kind of... Uh, guard Point's like one mana combo for 3K and then it's a trigger um give your leader 1k for the turn uh off of your shield that's that's huge that since you being in dragon ball big deal um your leader at a 5k is getting attacked a lot your leader at a 6k actually doesn't get attacked that much at least in the starter deck war so again requires energy investment into attacks which is a good thing so i agree that guard point being pushed to four is very is a very good thing but mm -hmm. Would you consider cutting the field spell for the guard points instead? Yeah, yeah, I I would like to just play a couple more games with the field spell. I think if I draw the field, if I go second and I draw the field spell on turn one, uh, it's not the worst card in the world. Um, I would like to just test the field spell a little bit more. It's nowhere near as good as Onigashima, so I would never put it past the two of that it already is. But I really mm -hmm. don't feel like it's a bad card. And I think it has infinite more value than Chopper or Karu. I could agree with that. Yeah. Um, now, Karu is an interesting thing because it's like, this is my going first card, but not in this deck. You have Nami. Nami is yeah. your turn one play every time is what you want to see. I even agree. if you go second, even if you go second, I feel like Nami's the play and not necessarily the ship because Nami's also a body on board. Nami represents as small as it may be a friend. Mm. Yeah, Nami's very and, strong. Okay. Yeah, no, I agree. The, yeah, you want Nami turn one, of course. Yeah. Yeah, the way your deck works with, like, Sanji and Zoro and Jinbei, it, Nami facilitates those guys. Like, Absolutely. if Nami's on the board, Sanji is always a rush because of your leader effect. Like, yeah. Sanji is two-mana rush. Uh, if you have two Sanjis, that's cool, too. But, like, this, the Sanji is a rush, and rush is very impactful in this game, especially on a yeah. 6K body. Where right. Sanji becomes he's a little torpedo. Dead. He like he swings and then he explodes because he also is gonna die. But he's like a little <laughs> torpedo. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. 
Uh, Sanji reminds me a lot of the the like Saiyan Kaba. Is Absolutely, yeah. Ball, Saiyan right? Kaba, yeah. That's what I literally explained uh, Cavendish as Saiyan Kaba. That's like exactly Cavendish, what I explained it as. Yeah. He is a hundred percent Saiyan Kaba. Yeah. Um. So. Yeah. I I definitely, I definitely don't mind cutting Karu. I mm. kind of value Chopper more than Karu. I, I kind of value I agree. Walker more yeah. than one K counter. So yeah. I I can see. Let, let's see here. So we definitely want Zoro at four, yep. and we want Brook at four. So I could see cutting two and two, two Karu, two Chopper, to kind of keep your combo power up there. Mm. Buff your Brook. So you you drop two Karu for two Brook, so you keep the combo, mm -hmm. but you actually get better on it. Yeah. And you drop two Chopper for two Zoro, and you've got uh, you haven't changed that ratio at all. And then if it was me, I'd cut the stupid field spell for guard point, but I could see cutting two more Karu or two more chopper for the guard point. I don't hate mm -hmm. either of those options. Yeah, and then we do then we cut the final two cards for the extra two big Luffy, the five drop. Uh yes, the five drop Luffy for sure. Yeah. Um Yeah, which that could be anything. What does Usopp do? Uh Usopp is pretty good. So he's a trigger, play this card, so he's a shield trigger. Um Oh wow. I think That's he's nice. Don too. He can't be blocked uh, by his three cost or less. Uh, he's not that good, but the fact that he's a shield trigger makes him more playable, in my opinion. Uh, yeah, free bodies are free bodies. Like, yeah. That can't be ignored. I, I agree. Yeah, it's like drawing an extra card, basically, without spending the energy for it. Also, in the late game, you have uh, like 10 energy. The shotgun in one piece is yeah. put 10 energy on something and hit you in the face with it. Yeah, Usopp absolutely. Can't be blocked when you do that. Yeah. There's no negate attack that we know of. I yeah, know. at least not for today. You know, maybe tomorrow, right? Who knows when the That's next? That we yeah, know of. who knows when the next cards will get revealed? But okay, so here's what we're gonna do, right? Cut two Diablo yeah. Jambe for Gum Gum Pistol. Okay. Easy. Here's what Easy I'm gonna spell. try. I I agree with you okay. that this field spell is kind of mediocre, but I want a couple more games with it just to see like how much I like it. So what I'm gonna do is cut four Karu. I'm gonna add two Burke. I'm gonna add two Luffy. I'm gonna cut four Chopper. I'm gonna add two guard point and two Zoro. That's what I'm gonna do. I agree with you that I could play two chopper over the field spell. However, I just want a couple more games to see if this field spell is actually maybe maybe it'll perform a little better in a game or maybe not. You know, I just want to try it out. I respect it. I respect yeah. the heck out of it. Uh, I think that those decisions are very solid, and I think that turns this starter deck into a legitimate competitor. Mm -hmm. I would hope so. Yeah, I, I hope to draw back to back big Luffy. That that's like that's gonna be this deck's blowout play. Turn five or not turn five, but five like five energy play Luffy. Six energy play Luffy. All right, we're good to go. I I, I think we can yeah. we can definitely win a game that way. It's a goddamn wrap, right? Or yeah. if you just have two of them on ten energy, you're just oh yeah <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, absolutely. So I I think we're I think we're good on that one, right? Yep, I think so. So we'll pause it over and we'll switch over to Kaido. All right, all right. We got Kaido here. Sublet, uh, you played Kaido yesterday. Um, what do you think we're gonna do? Your deck has a lot more effects, so I feel like it's a lot uh, easier to just cut vanillas for like more effect cards. It does. Uh, th this deck is a bit different than what we saw with your deck, though. Yeah. Um, so let let's start with the extra cards, like we did with yours, right? Mm -hmm. So we've got uh, the 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 Brachio card is my removal, right? Mm -hmm. it, it's six mana, nuke a dude that uh, costs six or less, so basically kill anything that we see right now, uh, except in the mirror match, I guess. And then you ramp one, and that's pretty good. And if it's flipped off the life, you ramp one. Those are great effects, but it's not enough to play four of. So mm -hmm. I definitely like it at two. The card to the left of it, however, that's the card I want to see on my shield trigger. That card is uh, mm -hmm. nuts. Yeah. So what it does is... For four, you draw one and ramp an energy. In active mode. In active mode. Yeah. And uh, Brachio's in active mode as well. Yeah. And then if um, if it's flipped off the life, you draw one and ramp an energy, which yeah. is nuts. Um, so I definitely want to bump that up to four. And as much as I like Bolo Breath, it is expensive. Yeah. One energy and nuke an energy. To get that plus four plus four is a lot but i don't think it warrants with no shield trigger i don't think it warrants a four up mm -hmm. i think that you immediately cut bolo breath to two 
and you bump up uh, whatever the crud that card is called to four. All star disaster. I 100 percent agree with you. Oh, it's a disaster. Um, when it it's a disaster. Up yeah. <laughs> yeah. So 100 percent. And unlike your field spell, which I don't think you run any copies of, Onigashima is a four of. Absolutely. Uh, I'd play five if, if I could. Guys, <laughs> I know. If you guys saw the game, the games yesterday, I had that card both games on turn two, and it just carried. Like, I was always up on energy. I was always able to do nutty things. I used my leader's neg seven effect two turns in a row. Yeah. <laughs> um, yeah. Like, Onigashima is a great card. If you draw too many copies of it, there are a lot of cards in the deck that let you discard it. Or you just slam another one on it, get another energy yeah. in that late game to get that sneaky burn. Mm -hmm. So as far as it at four, it's really good. Um, if we look at the cards that have effects, you can already see how unfair this deck is compared to Luffy. Uh, I already have four ultis. Ulti is my zero 2k combo. So <laughs> Luffy out of the box has only two 2ks. And Kaido has four, mm. so it's, it's rough there. Um, yep. Boss Monster Kaido is a card I would not play more than two of. Yeah, I completely agree. It's it's huge, right? I, it's, honestly, yeah. Honestly, I'd play one. I don't. I don't think that card is very good. Yeah. I think that. Really, it's not I mean, situationally, good. it's gonna be good. You know what I mean? No, nah, it is. Snap gets replaced by the Kaido out of the set. Um, well, a lot of these cards get replaced out of cards. <laughs> but, like, in starter deck meta, though, like, it's a good... I think so, actually. King is very No, no, no. Good. But, like, all, all the vanillas in both decks, I'm assuming, are getting replaced by similar costed creatures. You know what I mean? Sure. Yeah. Sure. But what I'm saying in this case is I'm looking at my two boss monsters side by side as Kaido and King. King is a four of. Oh, absolutely. Kaido, yeah, absolutely. Kaido, I had in my hand both games against you yesterday. Yeah. And I didn't want to play him. He was just never the right call. Right. Uh, it was always better for me to progress my board state and destroy yours than it was to pay nine and get a sneaky rush. Kaido is a card I'll only ever play one. You know, Kaido also KOs a seven or less, right? No, I'm aware. I'm, <laughs> I'm just, with that. I just, like, I don't know. I agree, I agree with everything you're saying, right? Because he's also, he's nine mana, neg five energy, which is yeah, just he, that, extremely lot. high costed. I agree with you. Yeah, you could play one. That actually, yeah, you you, you make it. You make sense. I agree. So, here's my biggest reasoning with Kaido. Yeah. Um, if I want to play a rush card, I'm gonna do that the same turn I burn you. Yeah. Because I'm not gonna burn you, unless I'm gonna burn you again the next turn, or I'm going for game this turn. Right. And yeah. I can't burn you and Kaido in the same move. Mm -hmm. Correct. Because yeah. Kaido neg fives. Even with Onigashima on the board, that's only six. I yeah. can't get to seven. Because I will have spent all of my energy on Kaido. Yep, Kaido I agree. is a card. That, Ka Kaido is a card that I don't want to resolve every game. I want to resolve like once every other game. Um, yeah, no, that's also, perfectly a, reasonable. Yeah, he's a nine drop in a deck with five and six and four drops that I want to play. Like it's he's so expensive even in a deck like this because I can never get more than ten. Ten is my cap. Kaido is the only thing I can do in a turn, and with this deck, I can do so much more. Mm. No, so, that, that makes perfect sense. I, I agree. Yeah. So I look at Kaido versus King, and I immediately want to make King the all-star of the deck yeah. and put Kaido to one, maybe. Um, we don't have to. I'm just like talking about my boss monster compared to yours. Yeah. Yours costs five and has rush. Mine costs nine and has to neg five to get rushed. Mm -hmm. He doesn't even get rushed without the neg five. Yeah. So, like, I have to set myself back. I have to go all in. Mm -hmm. I have to close at that turn. And he costs nine in a deck that does drop its own energy a lot. And it just doesn't... I don't yeah. know. From what I, I, I agree. Yeah. It doesn't yeah. much. A I card, agree. Cards that... Yeah, so cards, when I look at this, that I want to play a bunch of... Uh, what what is this dude with the lipstick called? Who's who? Yeah, he he's a four of. He's got to be right. Yeah, yeah. So uh, who's who is neg one kills something that costs three or less. Yeah, that's and a, a shield dead, trigger. Right, that's a dead Zoro. That's a dead Jinbei. Yeah. He's he's a shield trigger. Yeah, yeah. He's shield like, trigger play this card. Yeah. Does he kill something when he does that? Yeah. Oh yeah. No, he's super good, bro. He's <laughs> auto four of absolutely. <laughs> Yeah. Sweet. Yeah. Chesco didn't tell me yesterday this card existed. So I was unaware. It wasn't in the deck. Let me tell you something. That's a four of. Uh, God. Okay. 
Um, so yeah, that that card goes to four and. You there? Drop the audio. Sorry All about right. that, everybody. Yeah. My internet just completely pooped out on itself. <laughs> yeah. Oh anyway, yeah. Who's who's a, who's who is a four of for sure. Uh, Queen is a better blocker than I. I don't know who this chick. Black is. Maria. Um, all right, and then yeah. Black Maria. So I could see dropping two Black Maria for two queens. They also both combo. So again, that's something we talked about in deck building. Yep. You want exactly. to, by the way, we're gonna say counter and combo interchangeably for the okay. entire <laughs> rest of the, the One Piece uh, card game. Be like, it's just, it's ingrained to us to say combo. So when we say combo and we're talking about One Piece, we mean counter, it's the same thing. If you play Dragon Ball for five seconds, you know it's the same thing, all right. Um, so. Black Maria and Queen both counter, um, so we're not making the deck too heavy. Again, heavy just means not having enough counter pieces in your hand. Mm -hmm. And, uh, man, it is real hard to cut cards from this deck. Like, everything's so good. You cut Jin <laughs> Rummy, right? I mean, she, again, one cost. The one drop, yeah, the one drop gets the cut. The one um, drop, three, uh, three power. Yeah, so, like... This deck doesn't actually need a one drop. This deck doesn't need to do anything mm -hmm. on turn one. It, it's just not important because I'm e even if I go first, I'm gonna ramp, and if I go second, I can play uh, Sheep's Head. Sheep's Head actually isn't that bad. No. Nah. Uh, two cost four K does put in work. Mm -hmm. So I don't I don't hate Sheep's Head. I do hate her name is Jin Rummy apparently. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Sorry about the names, everybody. This whole thing's a spoiler for me. So. <laughs> It kind of is what it is. Oh, she, I, I, she's not poor. I had like no idea who she was when I saw the card either. I had to look her up. <laughs> Fantastic. All right. So we got to cut uh, four cards to put king to two and uh, who's who to two. So I think Jin Rummy immediately just subs in for those guys. Yep. That's fair. Um, it mm -hmm. drops my deck's combo power, but there is an alternate option here, and it's dropping the last remaining two Bolo Breath. Uh you know, this deck is very spell heavy. Twelve is a lot. Yeah. And Bolo Breath just it just doesn't strike me as a card that's too amazing. It's good. Don't get me wrong, saved my butt yesterday. Mm -hmm. Um so I I'm kind of torn on it a little bit as to whether it needs to go or it needs to stay. Mm. What do you think? Um I would say, so my thoughts are, yeah, cut Jin Rummy for two King and two Who's Who. And then, do we want to bump Jack up to four? Uh, which one is Jack? Jack is the discard. He counters and he's discard one from hand, ramp one. Oh, He's the uh, Mastodon. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So what I was going to do was uh, cut the remaining two Bolo Breath for two Jack. Yeah. And then do we want to cut two Black Maria for two Queen as well? Um, so, so Queen goes to four for two Black Maria. Yeah, we already talked yeah. about that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so cut Sheep's Head for King and, King and Who's Who. Uh, cut the two Bolo Breath for Jack. I don't hate that. I don't hate that at all. Yeah, put Bolo Breath to zero, right? Yeah, put Bolo Breath to zero, because we cut two Bolo Breath for All-Star Disaster already. Um... Yep. God, I don't know. That's tough. Do we... That's a solid. It's hard to cut cards. We could cut two X-Drake for two Jack and keep two Bolo Breath. Uh, that way... But, uh, like, I... it just... It depends on how badly you want Bolo Breath. Oh, don't you want to... Do you want to cut one of these nine drops as well? I mean, we could kind of... We could I play... Could, yeah, there's a... They have a floating nine drop right now. So, so we I'm could... Gonna, I'm going to swap it for whatever we have a hard time cutting. Yeah, so we could cut a nine drop for a third jack, and then we could cut one X Drake for a fourth jack. Then we're playing. Well, I don't know. Actually, Jack and I like X Drake. Um, jack isn't that good, admittedly. Jack is what you play when you don't have Onigashima. Yeah, yeah. No, I mean he just combos basically. You know what I mean? Yeah, I do. X Drake is an attacker, and this deck doesn't have a lot. Uh, this deck has Ulti and Page. Yeah. And that's it. Like, that's it for your early game attackers. So having Drake as an aggressor that doesn't require an energy investment, I don't hate it. Uh, he gets comboed off a lot. I, I will be honest about that. Yeah, a lot but, of these. Yeah. A lot of these cards are hard but, to play. I mean, you know what I mean? Because it's like, when do you find the time to play a four-cost vanilla, you know? Yeah. 
Well, so what I would actually do is this blocker. I'd cut two blockers for queen and two blockers for jack. Yeah, I don't value blockers very highly. Do you? I value the five drop blocker. With well, and yeah, I, I don't. I think <laughs> that card is a blocker like as an afterthought, but I don't value like generic blockers for pretty <laughs> highly. Is. Yeah. That card is blocker in quotes. Yeah. Really, it's attacker. Yeah. That happens stop and attack the turn it's played <laughs> yeah that also happens to draw two discard one yeah no that card does a lot <laughs> yeah <laughs> all right that a four of, yeah. Uh, yeah so we can try it out right because ultimately like if you're not playing black maria or jack i think jack is just a little bit better and they both combo so you, you know you might as well just play four jack at that point so cutting Jin Romy, cutting black maria just go into four ofs on all the good cards four king four queen four jack four who's who Cutting uh, two Brawler Breath for two of the All-Star Disaster, and then we're keeping two Brawler Breath. That's right? Correct. Yep, okay. that's right. All right, so we're going to build these and untap, uh, and now we're going to do a second playoff, uh, but this time with more optimized starter decks. So we'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Um, sub, we'll just talk about the mold. We already mulled, but like, Sub, would you agree that you're hard mulling for Onigashima in your Kaido deck? Uh, you're either hard mulling for Onigashima or you're hard mulling for Jack. Okay. Yeah, I agree with both of those things. Uh, if yeah. you don't have Onigashima but you do have Jack, would you keep? Yes. Okay. Fair enough. I don't. I don't hate that. I open. My hand's pretty good, right? Go ahead. Oh, yeah, I see the Nami. Yeah. The reason is like going first or second. I can play a three cost on turn mm -hmm. two. Yeah. And both of those ramp me as if I was going first. So. Yeah, I agree. It's yeah. pretty good. And you're gonna be pretty lucky this time, cause uh, boys, we don't have we don't have the dear sweet Onigashima. Hopefully, <laughs> yeah, I'll top I mean, deck it next turn. Yeah, you gotta turn. You gotta turn in a life, right? Cause I'm gonna attack you yeah. for sure. <laughs> oh, I'm I'm aware you're gonna attack me. Uh, yeah, we don't have any plays. I don't have Sheep's Head either, so we're just gonna pass it up. I got you. So we're gonna draw, grab two Dawn. Um, yeah, my curve is just good. So, like, I'm just not mad at my curve here. Um, I mean, if you have Sanji, then you're pretty legit at this point. I don't, but I have, I mean, I have Zoro. It's, like, a good battle card. Uh, pretty god dang good. Dude. It's just a good battle card. I'm going to go ahead. Nami's effect, Luffy's. I, I'm pretty sure you're going to take this, but we might as well just make it a 7k. So, let's go ahead and swing. All right. One time. Who's who off the top? Punish the Zoro. Oh, wait, yeah. No, wait, wait, let me go, go for it. Yeah. Okay. Punish the Zoro. Yep. Punish the Zoro. Ah. Uh, okay. All right. Very important misplay that I didn't get punished for. <laughs> you did. Yeah. Uh, you attack and then play. I'm not used to shield trigger. See, now I could have I could have learned the lesson in the hard way, but I got lucky. So we definitely, um, I think we all learned a lesson there. I'm just not used to shield triggers. I'm, I'm used to Dragon Ball. You know what I mean? Dude, Chesco lives in the world of never punished. Like, it doesn't matter. Bro, <laughs> just... I don't open up that many windows to get punished. Let's be, you know, come on. That was a big window to get punished. Like, I... that was a game being punished. I agree it was. <laughs> Always lucky. Right. Oh, we Gucci now? Can I go? Yeah, go. I passed turn already. Yeah, go ahead. All right, well, we all learned a lesson there. That's why you play test is because if you make that move in a tournament, you're very upset. If I make it get here, I'm not that mad about it. Yeah, we learned. Yeah. All right. We got some um, interesting choices here. Mm. <laughs> what is the best way to do this? Um. Yeah. No. Onigashima here kind of blows. Uh. We'll go ahead and push that faith. Always lucky. Lead. Uh, take advantage. I get to draw a card here. Oh, okay. Yeah, my bad. I forgot. I'm supposed to draw it to play. It's not a shield trigger, but I'll do that next time. All right. Is it a comboable card? Since you know mine was comboable. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go ahead. It's Nico Robin. Okay. Oh, ah, look at that. A card to play next. Card turn. to play next turn. Not. Yeah. Eh, pretty good. We're gonna play Drizzy here yeah. and uh, pass it to you. All right. Untap. A refresh. Draw. All right, I've been thinking about how to play a little differently. So I actually am, uh, let me get my Dawn first. I've been thinking about like different ways to play and I'm gonna try out a different strategy this game. All right. Um, so we're gonna tap four. 
Oh, Frankie coming down hot. No, we're going to just kill your Drake. Oh. Yep. He did. <laughs> he did. I, I'll I'm tell gonna, you, he did. I'm going to Nami uh, energy on Zoro. So he's now a 7k because he gets one from the Dawn and one from his own effect. And I'm going to okay. declare an attack on your leader. So he's a 7. That's a damage. That's a damage. Oh, oh, there we go. All right. Go. Better late than never. We're going to oh, attach this active mode energy to Luffy, and then we're going to use Luffy's effect to give him another energy. So he's now a 7k, and I'm going to swing lead. Yeah, that's going to be a damage as well. All right. I, can do about. All right. We're doing a little better than last time. Oh, no. <laughs> Damn it. <laughs> and there we go. Is that a dead Zoro uh, or a dead Nami? So <laughs> I think it might be a dead Nami. Uh, Ripper Reno. It's real tough for me to pick which one to kill on this, to be completely honest with you. Um, I gotta look at. I, so I'm gonna lose a Don here. Uh, let me let me think about this by looking at my hand. Yeah. Damn, bro, shield triggers suck. They have to. <laughs> <laughs> and turned around. Um. Yeah, I was in, I was in a really good position because I was gonna yeah, combo. Her. The Zoro. Yeah, I think we're you have to. She, this he's, is this in, a big tempo thing that gives me an opportunity. Yeah. Ah, oh, that's so unfortunate. Okay, whatever. We roll with the punches. Go ahead. All right. So I'm gonna. Like you said though, off. if that's turn one, uh, if I did that last turn on accident, then I probably I immediately lose. I think I'm still in. I mean, I'm still in the game here. Uh, I'm gonna make you out of the game though. Oh, great. <laughs> so we're going to do this to give me an energy, mm -hmm. discarding that card, and we're also going to play Onigashima. So I'm mm -hmm. going to gain two energy this turn, mm -hmm. which puts me back in the game. Mm -hmm. So all my energy is tapped. Okay. Now, a real interesting question is, do I push this damage here? Uh, inevitably, the answer is probably yes. Uh, in which case, I should have attacked before I did any of this, but honestly, I wasn't too committed to the attack. Uh, and I'm still not really committed to that attack, to be completely honest with you. Because um, I'm going to have to defend something here. I mean, if he just has Luffy that swings, then I won't. But there are other things that he could attack with, like God dang Sanji. Uh, and honestly, I can't risk giving him a Sanji. Giving him a Sanji is pretty much admitting defeat here. So I just have to pass. I can't risk that. I'm not mad at that. I, of course you're not. Yeah, well, I, there's no reason for you to be mad. No, I just mean I don't disagree with that play. Oh, yeah. It's hard to aggress the aggressor. It is, yeah, <laughs> because you're giving me more resources, yeah. Mm-hmm. Alrighty, um, let me get my Don. Ugh. So I have a big Luffy. Ooh, big Luffy. Big Luffy is probably a damage here. Now, the real question is, do I want to do that that way? Nami, I mean, Nami's cool. Uh, if I top deck another big Luffy, I mean, that's pretty strong. There's also no guarantee he can kill my big Luffy without drawing a king. I mean, king just kills it immediately, but, I mean, whatever. I'm still at four. I th We're not, ah, dude. I'm, I think I'm going to big Luffy, and I'm, I think I'm going to leave it up to luck. Because if I take a couple damage and draw one card, there's a strong chance that there's another big Luffy in there. And I would really, really like to get him down to either... Um, I'd like to get him down to zero life. That way I can just shotgun my leader, you know what I mean? Yeah. Alternatively, I can play a Frankie. That's so bad. Like, if I play Frankie and he plays King, I'm just, okay, rip. Um, I don't have it. I would also really love a Sanji here, because I would just play Sanji, equip all, a bunch of Don to it, and swing. Okay. Um, we also, I don't know, what's, you know how in Dragon Ball, like, it's best to attack at 25? What do you think the best number is in One Piece to attack? Seven. Seven because you have to discard your two K and a one K. Yeah, that's fair. Yep. No, I agree with that. Yeah, seven, seven is the number. You've swung with seven on everything, so I haven't been able to get out of it easily. All right. Um, Except for two to three cards to get out of. It's it's kind of rough, honestly. Yeah. So we're gonna go for it. We're playing big Luffy. We're doing this so I can attach rested energy to it. Um, 
I really want this to go so this is I'm think I'm not I might not do eight, but this is eight and then Luffy is seven. So I feel like you'll out combo the leader, but you won't out combo this. Because this is discard three, which is a lot. Um but I need to leave one energy up. So we'll do two sevens. Yikes, that's not that good. Um, do I really need to leave one energy up? I mean, I have guard point in my hand, but I don't know. I mean, guard point protects Luffy from an attack. Yeah, it's basically like a coercion, right? It's like, yeah. but I would, I really, I want to push. So if I swing at you with, two sevens you take one that basically means i have to top deck a luffy to win which is like super neg so i need to make sure like, i really need both to go in so i think i'm gonna do eight and seven so or seven and eight rather so this dude's a seven and okay so let's go declare attack here for seven uh all right we're gonna have to discard three cards to get out of this all right yeah i'm not mad at that at all either two drakes and a queen. Yep, yeah, okay. Uh, now we're going to use Luffy effect, attach one to him. And I'm going to chicken out. He just discarded three. So if I do another seven, he would have to discard another three. So I feel like I can still leave one up and this will still go through. So I'm going to declare an attack for seven. That's a damage. Yeah, I, f I felt like that was not bad. And another Drake. All right, cool. Um, and then I'm going to leave one up for my guard point <laughs> that he doesn't know I have. And I'm going <laughs> to pass. And I'm going to really, really hope he doesn't have a king because that just kills my king Luffy for free. Him. Yeah, it does. Six king or less. Know. Five or uh, four or less. Oh, it's a four or less. Oh, damn. Okay. All right. Mm -hmm. You got big Kaido. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All right, he could big Kaido. That does, that does kill Luffy. That's seven or less. <laughs> that does kill Luffy. That is a fact. Um, mm, I'm thinking about what I want to do here. I'm not in a super good position here. Big Luffy is a lot. Rush is a strong mechanic that I hope they don't put on that many cards. Hmm. What is the best way to do this? The best way to handle this turn? All right, Luffy's just a 6K, right? Right now he's back to normal, yeah. So he's just a 6. All right, I'm going to buff my leader and attack him. Okay. I am going to protect him by discarding Usopp. Okay. Uh, I'm going to buff Jack mm -hmm. and attack him. I will protect him by discarding another card. Okay. Uh, Brachio Bomb, kill him. Mm -hmm. Yeah, we made him use all his energy. It's not the worst thing in the world. I get another energy. Uh, mm, yeah, that's fine. I mean, what are you going to play with one? You know what I mean? Yeah, I know. You're not, like, super advancing your game state. Uh, I did advance my game state by making you discard two cards. I couldn't play anything with that energy anyway. Mm -hmm. Okay. Well, whatever, bro. <laughs> it's like I'm, not mad, I just, I'm not mad at it. <laughs> well, no, I just had to, like, I had to do what I could to make you... Yeah, no, I agree. You can't, you can't let Luffy survive because then the chance of me winning is extremely high. Yeah. Killing the um, Luffy gives you, like, another... Like, it basically gives you another turn. Unless I top deck a Sanji or a Luffy. Yeah, pretty much, right? All right, uh, crit of life. Yep. Draw to drop. Let's see what it is. Uh, it was another Nami. Okay. All right, so I'm only going to get rid of six because I'm going to Onigashima one of these back. That is fine. I'm doing this here because uh, I I would gain zero energy at the start of my next turn. Yeah. So this really, with, because of Onigashima, this only cost me four energy. Yeah. No, I completely and, uh, agree. You also have seven again, like, next turn. So you yeah, could exactly. do it again. So, like, you can tap all your energy, start going for the kill, and then burn. You know, like, I, I yeah, you definitely do it there. No, definitely. Mm 
All right, that is a pass turn. All right, G fucking G, buddy. Off the top of the deck. Uh, nope. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Psych. <laughs> You shut your dirty harlot mouth at that GG bullcrap. All right. Um, okay. Oh, I'm supposed to get two. Uh, now, this is interesting here. Uh, can you shotgun me down? That's exactly what I'm thinking about doing, is attaching eight energy to my leader and swinging. <laughs> um, I have one life. You have to hit me direct, remember? No, I'm, I mean, yeah, but that puts you at zero, and then I can theoretically do it again next turn. I don't know. Yeah, that is a problem. <laughs> yeah, that one life is so important to protect because of the shotgun. Mm -hmm. Like in Dragon Ball, you never want to go to two. In this game, you never want to go to zero. Mm, okay, I'll equip eight to my leader. <laughs> Mother of God. Declare attack on leader. <laughs> yeah, okay. Uh, that's, that's a damage, boy. 13, girl. buddy. Uh, All right. Much like last game. Do your worst, bud. We'll see what happens. Do your worst. I'm so sorry. I'm scared. <laughs> <laughs> I'm scared. Uh, Jesus Christ. All right, draw to play. I'm going to go ahead and get that Onigashima energy while I'm at it. Yep. All right. So, I mean, I could kill him. Uh, if he had zero combo power in his hand, I could... I could kill him, but uh, he's definitely got combo power in his hand, so Cred's not gonna it's not gonna fly all that well. So what do I do instead here? I don't know. Uh, Should probably play a blocker. <laughs> probably play a blocker. I'm gonna play a queen. Yeah. Alright, Nami. Looks like it looks like I'm gonna need you to do something for me. Alright, so queen, bottom decks and energy. We can draw two, discard one. Seems good. I'm gonna draw two cards. I'm gonna discard this card I can't combo with. Broken. All right, now the question becomes, do I aggress? Ah, oh, man. I gotta think about how I kill him. Uh, <laughs> it's a little dangerous. It's extremely dangerous. But at the same time, every turn I aggress, Oh man, if if I push and give him Sanji or give him Big Luffy or Big the Luffy. uh I guess I guess if you hit Jet Pistol I do win cuz then I kill your blocker. Uh Jet Pistol. Oh my god. Yeah, if you top deck Jet Pistol you win. Or if you hit it off my So I guess do you want to decide to attack hear. I literally, I can't risk it. I've got to, like, just build. I, I've got to build energy. All right, buddy. Stuff. What a fucking shame that I top decked the exact card I needed. Did you? <laughs> no. <laughs> not, not. It's like a BB? Quite the opposite. <laughs> Definitely the best card in my fucking deck. All right. Um, Karu? Is it Karu? <laughs> uh, Karu's gone. Bro, fuck. Bro, uh, who's... You, you, I'm not playing this. Bro, right, Usopp says 5k or less. You can still block Usopp with Queen. What the fuck? <laughs> Jeez. Alright. I have to make an attempt to get through your blockers. So we're going to do play Jinbei. That's a card. Because he doesn't combo anyway. So I, mean, I might as well just play him. Yeah, I put I tried to put you on a gotta have it because if you don't have a blocker there, then I feel like I could you know like I might not automatically yeah, win, good. but I I feel like if you don't have a blocker, I just go equip ten swing and like we just fucking play it by you know what I mean? Yeah, no, I I agree with it. I don't I don't hate your play at all. <sighs> so I mean, do I just go equip six and kill your blocker? Or fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, I guess we'll do that. We'll go Luffy's ability. Nami's ability. No, I'm probably gonna play like another battle card. Yeah. Um. I mean, it's not like you can shield trigger me, so I guess I could play it. But I'm gonna practice good habits because why not? Um, we're gonna equip two more to Luffy. So he's now a nine k, which I'm pretty sure kills your queen. So let's go declare attack on lead. 
9k, huh? Mm hmm. And I want to be greedy with that queen. Mm hmm. I can, I know. Yeah. You discard what? Uh, six cards from your hand? No, right? There's no way, right? I mean, I can block with queen and, uh, and then combo protect it. I mean, yeah, but then my Nami gets in there, bro. Oh, Nami can buffer. Did you, did you, you use Nami? I right? use both, both of their effects I've used. So, yeah. Okay. But I have five open energy, so I can make Nami. Oh no, a 6K. I'm aware. She becomes a six K. Yeah. You do she makes you discard one card for sure. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah, Queen's dead. Alright, okay. Um I just think I have to continue to play attackers because I, I don't like dropping combo out of my hand and the likelihood of him burning again is like a hundred percent. But I also need to play attackers in case like if he can kill my Jimbe, then he can't kill my Frankie and vice versa. I guess he would just I guess you would kill Jembe because he's a little better, right? I, I don't know 100%, but... Um, yeah, we're going to leave one up for our mystery card that he doesn't know about, and we're going to pass. Yep, I don't know at all what that is. All right, we're going to go ahead and use Onigashima. Mm-hmm. So I'm assuming he's going to burn this turn, which then means he has to actually deal uh, three damage. Two to life and then one to final. So, I mean, I, I don't, like, feel super bad. Because he also, the only charge minion he has in his deck is the big Kaido, which would prevent him from burning. So, I mean, I don't yeah. feel like I don't feel like I'm in a super bad... I, I definitely feel like I get another turn, which gives me another opportunity to kill. Yeah, it uh, <laughs> it looks like that, doesn't it? I don't know. If you, if, you, if you kill me, then kill me. <laughs> um, I'm going to buff my dude and swing. Swing on lead? Yep. All right. Uh, <laughs> how fucking greedy can I be? Let me think about it, right? So Kaido costs nine, which is all of it. Uh, and then you would neg five, so you definitely... Oh, damn it. I can't die. There's no way to die this turn, is there? Because then you can't buff... Ah, oh, I'm greedy as fuck. All right. Gum gum jet pistol one time, baby. Or Brooke. I'll take Brooke, too. Um, ah, damn it. What are these cards doing in my hand if not just burning a hole? Um, uh, you have nine. What do you do with nine energy? So you play king for six. That leaves you with three, which means you could probably... Oh, that leaves you with Sasaki? No. You queen... Queen is also six, or is he five? Uh, He's five. Queen, He's the drop area. He's at five. So... Five. Notice everybody who's watching. It's like, this is a mind game that could not be a mind game. I, if I pushed with six, he'd snap take it. Pushing with five, now he's questioning, do I give myself the ability to lose this game? That's what he's asking himself right now. He's like, do I snatch this yeah. game from the jaws of victory? But then if, if I, I like, do I discard a card. <laughs> yeah, but then it's like if I hit if I hit Brook, I get another attacker. If I hit, um, not Brachio Bomb. If I hit Jet Pistol, I kill who's who, which eliminates the only possible. He actually, I didn't, I didn't even realize you have two energy taps. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So you, there's no way to play Big Kaido. I think it's safe to take here. Um, it's extremely greedy, but I also think it's safe. And it's also going to be Big Luffy off the top. It's a Nami. Not, not, okay. I mean, I didn't really want that, but <laughs> sure. I'm going to probably play her next turn. <laughs> yeah, not the most spectacular card you could get there. Um, okay. I will attack you later. Okay. I will discard the Usopp. Now I definitely don't want to... I don't want to take this because then he burns me and then I'm at zero. Mm-hmm. That's a fact. <sighs> uh, okay. We're going to go with... 
ye old queen. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to tap five. Uh, we're going to bottom deck an energy. Draw two. Discard king. Okay. There's so many good cards I could draw off the top of my deck. There's so many. There's a disgusting number of good cards that you can draw off the top of your deck. That is a fact. Are you going to burn me? I'm thinking about it, but I don't think I'm going to. I don't know. That, yeah, um, I think it's kind of risky. I don't know that I need to burn here. Yeah. Uh, let's see here. Leave the two energy up for mystery cards that nobody knows about and pass turn. All right. All right. All right. Oh, that was a that was a fucking that was a good one. Okay. Is it a dude with rush? Because you just kind of win. Yeah, it isn't. Dude. It is a dude with rush. Yeah. <laughs> Is it Big Luffy or no, is it's, it? It's Sanji. It's Sanji. So we got we got uh, some energy to play with scary. here. That's less scary. All right. So he has seven cards in hand. I don't know that he like. I don't know that he doesn't play Bolo Breath. I don't even remember. I don't know if he has it or not. Whatever. I do. I do play Bolo Breath. I play two of them. Yeah. So I mean, it's not. I'm not going to equip ten liter swing as much as I'd like to. But <laughs> we're just gonna I, I'd like you to. Do. <laughs> we're going we're to space out our attacks a little bit. We're going to. Again, even though he doesn't have any shields, we're going to just kind of, like, instill that playing around shield triggers. So I'm going to attack with Jinbei first, which means uh, he can't kill it with a who's who. You know what I mean? Just, just These are just good habits you want to practice. So, I mean, I'm going to play Nami. Um, I'm going to activate this Nami's effect. We're going to equip this to Jinbei. This puts him at 6, which... If he decides to block, it kills. And I think we did. We did say we wanted to go to seven, right? Yeah. All right. Um, so before I play, I'm just going to... I'm not going to play anything yet. I'm just going to equip to seven. That way... Uh, he would have to... So ulti matches and then an additional card. All right. Um, yeah. Declare attack. Uh, all right, so you're seven. I am seven, and then he's gonna trigger. Uh, one, two, and three. Okay. Now who do I who do I want to buff? I guess just fucking. I guess it doesn't matter. I guess we buff. Uh, you buff Frankie, so you don't have to invest anything in his attack. Yeah, I think we. I think if I make him eight, no, you can't block. That's yeah, you just can't afford to block. No, I can't. I, I, I cannot because you have too big of a shotgun. I can't afford the block. Okay, so assuming the best for me would be you could get to nine. So if, if I make Frankie an eight, that's super strong. Um, I can also, I mean, I have like a, I can only spend two more energy this turn realistically. So I, I can afford to invest a little bit. So right now he's a seven. This would make him an eight. Um, I actually need to make you burn the Bolo Breath. So here we have him nine. at nine. Bolo Breath is four, right? So that's four Bolo and another four. card. So this is nine. So we declare attack on leader. I'm dead. Yep. That does it. Uh, I'll have to block that and then I just lose the leader shotgun. I only have 8k. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, we got one. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> not bad, not bad. All right, game two. I'm going to try going first. I haven't actually gone first in this game once yet. Oh, brag board, buddy. <laughs> uh, oh, no. No, no. Yeah, big Kaido burning a hole in my hand. Five it's cards. Just, it's hard to have nine. <sighs> this is not a hand I want to keep. I have no one drop. I'm going second, which means, like, I don't know, these Frankies are better going second, but I Nami was, like, putting in so much work that game. She did. That's why I wanted to kill her originally with the yeah. who. There we go. No, yeah, she put I, that pro might not have even been wrong because like she put in like hella work. Mm hmm. Uh, this hand is actually pretty decent, so I am definitely not mad. It's going to be your turn, of course. Okay. Um, draw for turn. Yeah, my hand's not bad either because I I just curve. Oh, that's. Yep. Drop a hand. Oh, hey, cool. Oh, cool. Nice double Nami I'm about to play. <laughs> oh, God. That's disgusting. Uh, yeah. Yeah, we're going to do that. God, my hand is all shield triggers. This is depressing. <laughs> uh, pass. 
Alright. That's so a hell of a stop. <laughs> it's not bad. We're gonna go ahead and get an Onigashima out here and get that going. There so, we go. Keep drawing these stupid things to my hand. Oh, I was about to say, I was like, bro, what the hell? How do you have nine cards in hand? Oh, okay. This is your I don't. Non. I, I don't know, know, I know, I know. It's just your non, yeah. Uh, I will go ahead and push on you. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take that. Okay. All right, and then, uh, yeah, that's your turn. Okay. Draw, play two. Right, I'm really ahead now. I'm at seven energy next turn. So. Yeah. Okay, so we play around who's who by playing a four cost. Yeah. Yeah, Frankie um, here is pretty sick. And then we do triple equip to Luffy. So Luffy's at eight. Because I'm using both yeah. mommies and his own effects. So I'm just, that's a damage. Go ahead. Flip your shit. It was, it was, you didn't flip yours. I, my, that, I keep forgetting. It's, I'm, it is a, tr it's a trigger, but I'm not going to use it. I'm just going to add it to hand. That's fair. Ooh, thank oh, you for fuck. the king, buddy. Shit. <laughs> shit. <laughs> Goodbye, Frankie. It was nice knowing you, buddy. <laughs> shit. Go ahead. <laughs> and just like that. All right. Maybe, I don't know. I don't know. How do All I... right. There's no way, but again, like he's not. If we're playing in real life, he doesn't actually reveal it. We're just doing that for the camera. Yeah. So it's not. Hilarious. Yeah, it's not like I'm like, oh, I'll play around the king. No, he just wouldn't show it to me, you know. Yeah. Uh, we're gonna use Onigashima and then mm -hmm. immediately burn it. With I'm sure, this. Are, bud. He's gone, gentlemen. Uh, I'm gonna attack. I definitely have the ability to be the aggressor here. I'm, I'm taking damage. <laughs> What it, is it? It's guard point. I, fuck. Again? <laughs> Jesus Christ. Whew, it's going to be hard to be aggressive. Uh, yeah, double guard point's not that bad, I mean. No, uh, that king, though, is a big tempo shift. Jesus. Now, he could have a hand of all rushers, and that is definitely making my balls itch. But uh, hopefully he doesn't. Bro, King's a 7K. What the hell? He's so good. <laughs> oh, he's got the fourth cost card to kill something in his hand. That's what he just told me. Bro. That is right. Those are the words that he just said. Am I right? Am yeah, I no, right? you're right. I mean, whatever. I can't, so this is the fucked up. God, dude, Kaido's Star deck's pretty good. I can't play Zoro because if I swing and he kills Zoro with who's who, so I could take the risk. But if I don't just waste mana buffing my Luffy, like, the damage doesn't go through. I think he takes it at 7. Like, I could play Zoro, buff my Luffy to 8. Ugh, it feels bad. Like, because then if this dude dies, then I'm fucked. It's so hard to play around shield triggers, right? Yeah, it's super hard. I can do this. So I can play. I'm playing this Nami no matter what. So play a Nami, activate Nami's effect, attach Arrested Dawn to Luffy. Die, dude. Three Namis is so much. It's a lot Jesus of Nami, bro. Christ. And if I leave three, I don't think I'm dying. I'm not I'm not gonna leave energy up for this fucking I'm not dying. I, I don't think so. So I'm not gonna leave energy up for this. So I can just do this. This is eight. I'll declare attack with eight. That's a damage. <laughs> and then Jesus I'll Christ. Tap three for zero. Ooh. Ah you fucking <laughs> god damn it! What the fuck? <laughs> Go. Fuck. <laughs> This is bullshit. <laughs> this is great. All right, so I'm going to draw. I'm uh, going to get to energy. Maybe I am or... dying. I don't know. I was wrong. I said I wasn't dying. I'm dying slowly. And he's going to burn me this turn. He's probably... God damn it. He can put me to fucking zero this turn. He's not going to, but he could. Uh, no, I'm not going to put you to zero this turn. Yeah, but I go to one. I take one from king and one from burn. Then I go to one. <sighs> Life is rough out here, boys. Right, life is rough. <laughs> I we gonna oni in that Gashima. Mm hmm. Uh, yeah, draw to play. There we mm -hmm. go. All right, so we got eight energy to play with here. Uh, we'll go ahead and push your leader. No. <laughs> is, is that yeah? I was gonna say, is that the top of I have to discard a card? <laughs> This is the difference Onigashima on turn two makes. Yeah, that card is super good. Mm -hmm. So, um.
Uh, yeah, kings of damage, so let's go ahead and just do that. Oh, that's where you're correct. <laughs> that's a damage. <laughs> what is it? Oh, my bad. Um, this dude is not a shield trigger. It's a brook. All right. Okay. I mean, it's not, pretty good. Yeah, it's, it's not a bad. It's going to be hard to die. Not a bad card. Yeah. So I'm not going to play the king because I don't need to play Thank the king. I can actually just widen my board here. Oh, man. You kill it anyway with who's who, right? Yeah, exactly. I can kill it with who's who. One, and then play a vanilla. two. Play a vanilla. And Ooh. then uh, one. Uh, and I'm thinking, like, do I really want to... That puts me in a potentially bad... Si okay, so you're going to 8 energy. Uh, you can Luffy me in the face. This Luffy. Uh, so you Luffy, you Sanji, your leader, and you Nami Dougie on herself. And that is that is 4 damage, potentially. That, that is... <laughs> That's a lot of shit I don't have in my hand currently, but that's good. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> He's like, go ahead, think that. Yeah, go ahead. Um, I won't stop you thinking that. I know you won't. I know you won't. Um, uh, I think instead I'm going to just play this page. Uh, I can't play the vanilla and the page. Mm -hmm. And there's no reason to. There's just no reason. I'd rather combo with the vanilla and force you to remove the page. Page is a six k. He, you're gonna have to respect it. You're gonna have to spend four energy respecting it. Yeah, I'm going to. Yeah, no, that's reasonable. Yeah. And you're at two life, and your hand is the worst it could possibly be. Brook guard point guard point uh, blast a damage thing. So that's not. That's not great. I'd make this play even if I didn't know what his hand was, though. Um, it's like, I honestly think that he has to use his leader to kill King here. Oh, I that's... Think that he King. <laughs> great minds think alike, bud. <laughs> it's just like, I think King is here. He has to die. This fire pterodactyl. Which, God, why is the pterodactyl on fire? And why um, is he bro, King's, full S&M gear? King's Can you broke. explain that to me? No spoilers. King's broken. That's why. All right, cool. Can he make fire, or is yes. he just always on fire? Both. Is he fire? He's not he ace, fire? no. Okay. All right, whatever, bro. Call my fucking bluff. Why don't you kill homeboy? Uh, page one. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> Tap two. Buff Luffy. Equip four rested Don to Luffy. Uh, one, two, three, right. four. So he is now a 10K. Mm-hmm. And leave two up for guard point. Uh, holy shit. I'm at 10. Bolo Breath immediately gets you out of it. Damn. <laughs> kind of so good. I'm at 10 right now, which I have to go to 11. So I guess I have to leave one. So I'll just do it this way, right? So, yeah. So I'm currently at 11. Attack King. Uh, we're going to counter with Bolo Breath. Oh. Damn it. And then I will happily discard this vanilla. <laughs> yeah. Mmm. Mm -mm. mm. Delicious. Mm-mm-mm. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Good. So you have one energy up, too, for that guard point, huh? I certainly do have one energy up. Go ahead. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that, your Luffy was huge. Yeah, he was all right. He's pretty big. That was when I slammed that other Kaido and you just scoop. Not yet. Oh, that actually showed up in a good position. That was fantastic. Mm -hmm. I don't think uh, I scooped a Kaido, but we'll see. No, I don't think you scooped a Kaido either. Uh, okay, how do we want to do this? If I do a damage to you... Um... So I got to play around the guard point because he left an energy up. Guard point is 3k? Guard point is 3k. Okay. Um, I mean, 
That's probably the way to go. Yeah, I just swing with a 5k here. I, I make him discard a card. You're... Yep. Uh, Alright, so his hand is pretty low. Uh, he's got energy for days and power for days, but that's not super important. So I'm going to Onigashima and then play this guy to draw a card, getting rid of the Don. Yep. Hilarious. Um, well, oh, okie dokie. Uh, that was. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. Why couldn't I have gotten you before, Jack? <laughs> uh, I think I think Chesco, you would have scooped if I had that card instead. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, okay, we'll go seven in. See if you burn the guard point on this. <sighs> uh, what you have a fucking hmm. six energy up. I mean, there's no charge in your deck. You could just equip it to page one, and you can burn me. Well, that'd be game, right? If you equip six to page one, if I take this, <laughs> so I will guard. Oh. Yep, I have a guard point going to eight. All right. That's interesting. Uh... All right, so I can't kill you any longer. It's okay. If you deal one damage, it's going to be big Luffy, and then off the top I get Sanji, and we're back in the game, baby. Uh, no, you get crit this turn. Um... Yeah, but if you deal one damage to me, it's big Luffy. And then top of the deck is Sanji. Alright, so we're going to play a king for right, six. Kill my Bulma. Goodbye, Bulma. So that goes there. I'm going to put myself at one to burn you. Or I can burn you next turn after playing some cards. Like, you still have to kill the king. That's the funniest part about all of it. Is that the king's still kind of just there? Um, so what do I do? If I burn you, that puts me at one energy. Next turn, I go to three spendable energy. I have a king. You'll be at one life. I don't. I don't. You yeah, don't need I to burn. I mean, you can you can just so. equip your energy and yeah. I don't think you definitely. Yeah, don't I, I don't think I need to burn here. Go ahead. That was a good turn for me overall. Uh, mm. Like, your hand needs to be exactly three Sanjis for you to kill me. <laughs> like, I think you just have to, again, try to kill King. <laughs> and you have to respect the fact that I will discard four cards to protect him, too. Which is hilarious. <laughs> Like your Luffy has to swing for 11. A quick 9 Don to Luffy, give it plus and swing. It's a dead ass king, buddy. I don't know. Yeah, so you're, told, I have to kill it. Yeah. Yeah. You have to respect the fact that I will discard four cards to protect Yeah. You. I can still kind of survive, and then I can make a comeback to kill you. So go ahead. All right. So he left one up again, so he's yeah. got another goddamn guard point. All right. So we'll put two in play. Okie dokie. Yeah, um, I, could, I could have attacked you twice instead of King twice, but you'd still be at one life. And it's like, I yeah. just, so I really, like, I just can't establish an attacker because you mm -hmm. have eight removal cards in your deck. Oh, All tough. right, so we're going to start here with a five. Take it, it's like, um, I wish I could combo these nominees off now. That'd be so nice. Um, uh, if off board this game would be so interesting it would be yeah right so go to one burn swing king yeah we're not doing all that um yeah i'll combo it all right cool 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 um so we will go to five mm -hmm. swing 
All right, so how does this work? Let me, now we have to think about, I mean, I, I, I lose here no matter what, but we still have to think. Um, Hang on one second. Well, you think, let me think about if I want to put this to six. Okay, uh, go ahead. You think and then I'll I think. think. <laughs> you think and then I'll think. <laughs> Uh, I actually believe that I do need to push this damage. Yeah, I have to push six here. Okay, so if I go down to one, I get to draw a card. Gum Gum Pistol does not kill King, so I can't sack my way out of this. Um, you have one, two, three. You You'd have to burn three energy, and then you'd equip three to King, making him a 10K, which I could get out of. But then you still have your leader swing. So this life would have to very specifically be like a comboable card. So I cannot take this, I don't think. I think you're gonna burn me no matter what. God damn it. Um, you're at six. The burn effect is a little too strong, it feels like. Yeah. Um, all right, so. You go one, you go swing, you go, okay, so you would, one, two, three, four, you go attach, if I outcombo this, you attach three to lead, which I can't outcombo, or can I? Three to lead would be eight. Yeah, I can't outcombo that. So do I just keep the card? Because then you go burn, attach, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven attach three and then king is 10 so your leader is at eight king is at 10 oh my goodness this is tough if i take this you burn and then you attach three to king which is at 10 which i can get out of i'm just is it like worth i guess i make you tap your energy Unless you have some random play I'm not thinking of. Three to lead is eight. Out combo. Burn. Uh, I think I think it's right to do this, right? Sorry I'm taking so long. That's okay. I don't care. Um, the audience has the fast forward button. They... Yeah, go ahead and hit that a couple times. <laughs> <laughs> Just double tap your screen, boys and girls. It's very easy to uh, skip Chesco thinking about taking this damage or not. I'll just combo these two Nami's up. <laughs> oh, broken. <laughs> Didn't think about that. Uh, leader goes to eight. Yeah, I'll have combo it. The, the thing is, like, there's actually a oh, miss... had another broken. I sure broken. did, bud. Um, there's actually a misplay sublet could make here that if I thought he would misplay, I would, I would like, just try... Because, like, it would put me in a better position. But I don't think he's going to misplay, so it's like... I'm just gonna play like I think he's gonna play right. That's fair. Some, uh, do you ever do that? Like you're like, yeah, my opponent's gonna misplay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, like hope that he misplays so that I'm in a better spot. Yeah, all the time. Yeah. <laughs> all right. So you have one card in hand. <coughs> you know what it is. It's hundred point. It's a hundred <coughs> card. It absolutely so, is. Uh, I actually just put king to eight and swing. Okay. Just guaranteed damage. Yeah, I'll take it. Yeah. <laughs> Trigger, guard point. Is it? Yeah, there you go. So now my leader's a six k for the turn. Broken. Awesome. Broken. That sucks because I don't know. So what? You burn seven. You go one, two, three, four, five. So six. You six. go to nine. Yeah. So and your, uh, leader goes, your leader goes to nine. Mine goes to nine. That's game, right? Uh, so I have to lose two. So my leader can only go to eight. Ah, oh, yes. Maybe maybe we got it, boy. Maybe we make it. Maybe we make that it. Guard, guard point just saved you. Pulled your balls out of the fire. I mean, All I guess right. if, it, well, if it was any card, it would have comboed for one, too, you know? Yeah, it would have. I mean, it's um, not like I can come back. You have fucking three life. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's not like I'm coming back from this. I know, I know. I'm just trying to think about now. I don't need to use my energy. I can just swing at a six and force that stupid card out of your hand, whatever it is. So let's kill the Nami. And then I'll Onigashima get the energy back. Yep. And then I will, in fact, burn that last life. Mm. 
Ah, that was big loogie. <laughs> Damn it. Three, My only comeback card. Four, five, six, and seven. And then I obviously just equip these two energy to my leader and hope that you only have 1k in hand. You, of course, have guard point and you survive. But there is not a single top deck in your entire deck that can get you out of this. So go right on ahead. Buddy. That's why you're wrong. Nope, you're right. <laughs> Zoro. <laughs> oh, Zoro tried, man. He tried so hard. Oh, Captain, my Captain. Are you going to spite kill the king? No, bro. Oh, swing again? lead, bro. Equip everything to Luffy and swing lead. All right, all right. Let's see what it is. It is... Sasuke. All right, uh, game card. three. There you go. Good game. Okay. Uh, all right. Game, I... Yeah, if I see him. I am going to go first. All right. It's so hard to tell if going first is better or worse. I don't know. You know, I won game one and I went first. So give me a Nami off the top, please. Damn it. This hand is good, but it doesn't have a Nami. It's actually, this hand is actually not good. I just have Big Luffy. and Just I, toss it. You got four Big Luffy's. Yeah. Ooh, I have in my hand? No, I'm keeping it. I don't want to know, bro. <laughs> Come on. Nami okay. one time, baby. Uh, Nami, you have had Nami every time. What are yeah, you talking hand... about? Last game you had three. I had to murder two of them. Yeah, his hand's kind of whack. All right, uh, face down pile, one Don and that pass. Is... Don't talk about Sanji's fantasy. You Go had ahead, three brother. Namis on the board. Go ahead, buddy. Yeah, that would be that would be something. All right, uh, we're gonna get two Don and pass a Rooney Doonies. Draw for turn. Okay, that's a pretty odd card. Um, and here comes the Zoro. Swing lead. <laughs> we could play around the shield trigger. <laughs> fair. It's very fair. Ooh, thank you for Zach. the rank. Play Jembe Pass. <laughs> Excuse me. Seems good. Seems good. All right, I'll draw. I'll get to energy. Uh, okie dokie. I'll attack weed. Um, take it. Draw to play. Oh, hello, Zoro. Not bad card. Yep. Oh, my God. Hello, God. Zoro. Goodbye, Jinbe. God damn, bro. What the fuck? These cards are so good. <laughs> Holy shit. All right, whatever. Yeah, removal's insane. <laughs> God, whatever. I mean, he doesn't have Onigashima, so it's not the worst shit in the world, but... I mean, I totally do. I just made the decision to kill Gene awesome. Bane instead. That's great. That's fantastic. I'm happy for you. Uh, yeah, play <laughs> these. I mean, yeah, we're going to play our Zoro, but we're going to, I guess, attack. We're going to do Spaceship. <laughs> spaceship. Buff Luffy, equip one with his own effect, and declare attack. That's a damage, buddy. That's yeah. a damage. And we're going to Zoro. Oh, Bolo oh. to the hand. Bolo breath. Go ahead. All right, untap everything, draw a card, get my two energy from hand. Okay, un, do, trois. Mm -hmm. Play this guy, discard. Mm -hmm. Oh, yikes. Yikes, double ramp in one turn. That is solid. Discard this, Oof. draw to play. Golly, that's Earth fucking one, good. Tap two, uh, before I do any of that, before I play him too, just yeah. attack your leader. Okay, Sorry. yeah, I'm taking it. That's okay. Uh, my bad, okay. it's guard point. I'm not going to trigger it. Okay. Uh, all right, then I'll tap three. Yep, yep, that's pretty good. Yeah, it is. Kill Zora. Oh, my God. Fucking Christ, this guy. <sighs> oh, fuck. <laughs> Go ahead, buddy. I'm going. Get this back. Fucking draw two. And you're at three. Do I just... Do I just... Do I just every turn equip everything to my lead and fucking swing fit? Is that is that just like a play that I haven't thought of where I just... Every single turn just punch, punch? I guess it is. Are you one punch, man? Like, how many big loopies you got in your hand? If the answer is yes, then maybe you do. I mean, shit. That might be, that might be the answer. 
Um, play Songoro. Play what? Songoro. Song let's yeah, go okay. Luffy's effect, and let's do equip one. Mm -hmm. And then let's do buff Sanji to seven and declare attack on leader. Uh, yeah, no counters, I guess. No, I'll, uh, I'll take that. That okay. is unfortunate to take. Uh, <laughs> You're, f oh my god, this guy. <laughs> Holy Wee. shit. This, uh, this is a blowout. Uh, I quit four to Luffy, swing face. That's nine. Yeah, that's a damage. All that's right. Too bad. Go. Yeah, this is why these optimized starter decks, bro. I'm telling you, they're like getting these who's who's is fucking solid. Imagine, oh, imagine you hit all starters after off that life. I'm scooping, bro. Like, <laughs> fuck, you got it. All right. What am I looking at here? I mean, you're not behind, really. Well, you're at one, and I'm at three. So I can afford to take. How, I can afford to just take however much damage and top deck big Luffy. Like it, I'm not behind. No, you're right. Uh -uh. Yeah. I'll attack. I'm about to. I'm taking all this damage. I, I'm just. I don't know if this is the right play, but we're going full idiot. My bad. It's Zora. Okay. Um. Trying to think about like where to go from here. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm gonna only Gashima this turn. Oh, okay, cool. Better late than never. Uh, honestly, I think the removal spells were way more important. Mm -hmm. No, I agree. Yeah, no, because I would—they're just more attacks you get off the board. Mm -hmm. And then I tap three for this guy, discard this king, grab an energy. Mm -hmm. All right, well, I've got a board of idiots, so I can definitely <laughs> push for game next turn if I live. The uh, odds aren't necessarily ever in my favor, but we'll see how it goes. Go ahead. All right. Um, <laughs> drop return. Yikes. Grab to play. Uh, so I have nine Don. Do any of these cards not combo? Uh, I guess I'll play the Zoro because he doesn't combo. What are the chances of him having another? Like, what are the, what are the chances of this one life being a who's who? Right? There's three on the board. Hundred <laughs> percent. Fuck it, it's bro. Me. Like, holy cow. It's me, dog. What do you mean? It's a hundred percent. I know. It's either that or it's like Brachio Bomber or it's the card that draws me a card. Yeah, but those don't kill my Zoro, which I'm okay with. No, they they do not. Or it's Big Kaido and you lose. I I don't know. Okay, so I want to. I would like to. I'm gonna kill something with this card. Are you gonna tap four and murk a four K? Great. It's, yeah. <laughs> congratu <it's> congratulations. Congratulations. <laughs> you I, murdered the crud out of yeah, it. Yeah. Let's do buff Luffy one. Let's go Luffy effect attach a Don and then let's attach one, two, three. So he is currently. That might have been a mistake. Hold on. I might not do that. <laughs> <laughs> I think I, I have to go. I have to go full hand because that's going to force you to play a blocker. Oh, you're, you're talking about not killing. Me. Yeah. Gotcha. So I have nine. Oh boy. So I'm definitely buffing Luffy with the with the spaceship. I mean, that's going to happen. Uh, yeah. So six, ten, thirteen versus. 
nine. You can definitely out combo nine, but I don't know that you can out combo thirteen. So let's fucking equip. Yeah, this is a plus seven. So six plus seven is uh thirteen, right? Yeah. So let's go swing lead for thirteen. Do you attach? Did you attach everything to it? No, I have two untapped. I'll, I'll, yeah, my bad. So 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Jesus Christ. Go ahead. Discard your all hand or don't. <laughs> right? It's like, God dang. Nah, that's freaking, yeah, that's a that's all a right. damage. I don't know. All right. Full don't idiot strategy is working perfectly. <laughs> Go ahead. All right. All right. So I can kill yeah. his blocker and then, again, just ping pong the board so we'll see what he we'll see what he has in store for us but i don't know i don't i don't feel horrible we might be able to snatch it i don't know yeah we'll, we'll see how it goes um okay i'll tap one buff this guy swing five nope okay fair enough Fair enough. Um, I'll play queen. Mm -hmm. I'll bottom one. Draw two. You did one too many. It cost five. You tapped six. Five. No, I tapped one to buff my guy to five, remember? Oh, I'm tripping. Okay, my bad. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. Then I will tap one. Mm -hmm. Swing five. Greedy. I could hit whatever the fuck this is called, jet pistol, and kill the queen. So leader burns for one. That puts me to zero. And then, I mean, I can out-combo your leader. I have a full handful of shit. Um, okay. Uh, one time, baby? Nope. Frankie. Okie dokie. Um, all right. Then I will... Off leader swing... Uh, oops, hold on. Yeah, you're good. Yeah, uh, burn. <laughs> Onigash I'm gonna Onigashima and then burn you, so yes. I'll lose all my tapped energy. Oh, Nami. Goodbye. Buenos noches, Nami. All right, and then I will. Hmm. I'll actually buff this guy to five swing. Okay. I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> Discard one. Yeah, five swing. Discard one. All right. Well, we're uh, crossing our fingers and closing our eyes on this one. Go ahead. All right. Uh, do I know that you have Bolo Breath? I know you have ulti. No. I, I don't think you know that I have Bolo Breath. I don't right. remember, honestly. Whatever. You're, you're, yeah, leaving, you're, you're leaving one energy of, so I'm assuming you have two ultis and one Bolo Breath, so. Where I'm baiting you. I mean, two. dog, we're going in. <laughs> I don't know what to tell you. I know you're going in, yeah. We're just, we're, it's on the table. All right, so Bolo Breath, <laughs> Bolo Breath is four, right? Yeah, Bolo Breath is four. All right, kill your blocker. Fuck this dude. He's dead as, dead as crud. Luffy effect, spaceship effect. Um, How big is he? I don't know. Um, okay. Uh, so You're so breath. afraid of the backwards punish, aren't you? <laughs> you yeah. like, I got these guard points, and I want to have these guard points. I do. I, yeah, I have double guard points, so it's just like, but does the double guard point matter? Um, I mean, I think double guard point does matter, to be honest, but... Okay, so Bowler Breath is 9, Ulti is 11, right? So that's 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So I am currently at 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, which is Bolo Breath, Ulti, and one other card. 
I don't have an out to a second blocker, so, I mean, fuck me, I guess. So, okay, what were we at here? We're at 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So, Bolo Breath is 9, Ulti is 11. And then you're assuming I can combo with every other 13, card in the hand. 14, uh, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. Um, Remember, my deck is heavy. Nah, it's a lot of spells. Yeah, I know. Uh, so I would need, but I would need you to have three out of seven as non comboables. Uh, so what, nine, ten, eleven, and then it would be twelve, thirteen, fourteen. Yeah, I need three more comboables in hand. Two of them have to be not comboable. Yeah, that's trash. That's fuck. I'm not doing that. <laughs> I'm just gonna see if we can survive. So let's do equip these. The question is, do I need to play a Zoro because? Um, that gives me an out to a blocker, kind of. Because you go to you go to exactly five, which means you can play one queen, or you could if I, fuck me, this is hard. Sorry. It's okay. So if I play Zoro, yeah, you could play. You can play king, but whatever, play your fucking king if you want. Who cares? Um, I mean, King just kind of loses me the game if I play him, to be yeah, honest. Yeah. All right, so now Luffy's at eight, um, which is just okay. bowler, just, like, just bowler breath. <laughs> cool. Bowler breath does neg me in energy, though. Yeah, you're right. Yeah. But you gain... Yeah, you're right. Um, hmm. Okay. We'll play Sanji because he cost one less. So we are at nine, which is Bolo Breath plus another card. Swing for nine. Uh, yeah, that is a Bolo Breath plus another card. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay. Play Sanji. Big facts on that one. Big facts on that one. And go. You don't want to give Sanji Rush and try it? No, I'm straight. <laughs> I wish you would. No, the one ulti in your hand that outcombos that, I'm straight. <laughs> that Yes, the one ulti in my hand that outcombos it. That is, that is a fact. Um, all right, so we got some energy here. And we will Onigashima for another energy. All right, you've left two up every single time. You have two guard points. That's obvious. Mm -hmm. um, it's tapped. You're, you're one of your energies tapped because of Onigashima. Oh, oh, yeah, yeah. I, yeah. I meant for it to be tapped. I was, wasn't thinking about it to even be yeah. in. Uh, yeah. Honestly, I'm just going to discard it with one of my cards effects. Nah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So how do I want to approach this situation? Double guard points a lot. Oh, God, it's so much. It's a pretty good amount. Your deck is just so big. Yeah, I don't think I can win. I genuinely, I genuinely do not believe that I can win this game. Interesting. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> yeah, it's unfortunate okay it looks like our full idiot strategy works equip all the dawn i mean we'll it see did. right we'll, we'll play it out but yeah i mean equip... uh, unfortunately it does look like it may have worked equip um, all the dawn to luffy and swing all right full idiot strategy works i'll attack 5k on your lead oh combo one yep okay Uh, put one on this guy. Back your lead. Combo to seven. Okay, so you combo to seven. That means your uh, last remaining cards are two guard point and either an uncomboable or another freaking brook. Wonderful. Uh, okay. Okay. Yeah, 
killing all your dudes was great, but it just didn't it didn't matter in the end. Yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah. I could never I couldn't establish a threat to actually capitalize on it. Yeah. Uh so yeah. Um Well, I'll do this cuz it's funny. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The quad quadruple who's <laughs> okay. Fair enough. Maga, you there? Uh oh, I'll pause it real quick. All right, little my bad, little um, little technical difficulty. So play the fourth who's who. Fourth who's who was so strong it knocked my internet out again. Yeah. I live in Florida and it's like raining and outside, guys. I'm doing my best. Yeah. <laughs> uh yeah, so ultimately there was just nothing else I could do. Yeah. I had the combo power. I needed him to go full idiot yeah. and dunk. because uh, I had double ult the cow. Bolo. Yeah, I just so, I didn't think about it. My turn. It was do it for the camera real quick, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Go All for right, it. So yeah, draw no, just... equip <laughs> equip Tanda Luffy, activate spaceship and swing. Yeah, that's, uh, that's 16. Yeah. I've got 9, 10, 11. Yeah, I'm dead. Okay. Sick. Um, yeah, ultimately, uh, I don't even think the idiot strategy was necessarily the thing that did it. I think it was that I had to keep nuking my energy to clear your guys. So my, uh, my question was, do you think you shouldn't have burned because you, you had 10 energy, right? You could theoretically equip that to each who's who and then attack with it. Or, yeah, or I guess or you could have kite. Well, I mean, I don't know about kite, but like, you know what I'm trying to say? Um, so I had two options there. I attempt, you, your hand was giant. It was. So yeah. I attempt to go 5k, 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 5k. That's not going to win me the game if you're at one life because you're just going to take one of them. Uh, my alternate win condition is burn you to zero, put you in a corner, and force you to go full idiot. Because mm -hmm. uh, I'm looking at my hand, I have no aggression, I have no blockers, I have nothing to save myself, I have nothing to do anything. So I need you to misplay. So I mm -hmm. made the play that made you have the chance to give me the win. Okay, right. Does that make sense? Like, if you're at that one extra life, I can't do anything anyway. This big Kaido is burning a hole in my hand the entire game. Uh, this card's not good. Uh, yeah, I think we learned that. Um, yeah. I think you straight up cut this card from the deck. I don't think you play it. Yeah, I agree. Oh, uh, yeah. Um, Fair enough. I drew all my who's who instead of having... I only had one in the life, which is unfortunate. Yeah. But uh, you going first was big there because you were able to play your three drop and instead of me putting Onigashima out... which You had to play who's who, who's who, yeah. I had to play who's who, yeah. I had to respect Jinbei because yeah. I needed to slow the game down to my tempo. My hand was not... I had, I had no kings. Yeah. Uh, I didn't get a king until late, and I just had to discard him for the ramp guy. Yeah. So, alternatively, do you think it might still be correct to just Onigashima there? Well, instead of... Be. Yeah. Um, I was trying the removal strat because it did really well in game two. Yeah. So, I kind of stuck with it, and I got to say, maybe I should have just left you with a Jinbei. Yeah, because you would you could have attacked Jinbei with your leader. It would just it would have been like what one more damage over the course of that turn. So, I mean, I don't know. Well, next turn, I could have cleared both of your dudes with two uh, who's who's. Yeah. Uh, had the Onigashima up so that one of them was free. Mm -hmm. I ended up being one energy short a lot. So. Yeah. So so do you think yeah? So just on turn three, play Onigashima no matter what. Probably. Probably. I think so we it's still like this is the second set. Now we're tied. Now we're tied, uh, baby. Tiebreaker. Maybe though, we'll, maybe we'll switch decks into a tiebreaker. I, uh, even though I have won more games than you. Hey, it's all. Hey, baby, it's all good. <laughs> we'll hit it in the tiebreaker, <laughs> baby. <laughs> Our tiebreaker will be when I'm playing Croc Block, and you're playing uh, Hit You in the Face, Kid. <sighs> yeah, yeah. In six months, when those cards get revealed, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see. I know, right? So, now, but we'll it's definitely more games with this. Uh, I would be interested to try Luffy. 
Yeah, we can do like a little switcheroo for the tiebreaker. All good. Mm-hmm. Um, so this was optimized starter deck. So we took out, we changed cards, and we learned, right? So this, I said I wanted to play with this with the Thousand Sunny a little bit more. I genuinely do not think this card is bad. Like I think it provides just a little bit of value over the course of turns. I agree with you. This nine drop Kado is super mid. I 100% agree with you that we could end up cutting this for whatever, right? Um, literally anything. Literally anything. I agree. Yeah, more you know, go back to a, a, a gin rummy or whatever. Just anything else, Honestly, right? Gin rummy is better than this Kaido as far as our testing has been so far. Yeah. I have had this in my hand almost every game we've played. Yeah. And I have never once wanted to play it. My leader burns the last damage, so this Kaido. Yeah represents nothing unless you're at zero yeah if you're at zero then i mean king is the same thing you know yeah yeah no it makes perfect sense okay so big this is why we play test guys because what do we learn right i learned don't play zoro and then attack with lead because i could have got extreme punished (laughs) um uh, you know i don't know like this is why you play test because you want to you want to get these mistakes out and then boom now the game is out and we're playing at tournaments Oh hey, look! I'm not. I'm now. I'm more used to playing around shield triggers because I don't come from games with shield triggers. So now I'm going to be used to playing around them by the time that this game comes out. So, um, all right, good games, bro. As always, everyone, thanks for oh, watching. Um, yeah, I'm. I'm so excited about One Piece. We'll, like I said, we'll probably do a little switcheroo and then you know finish up. But um, I really hope that we get these other two decks as soon as possible because I really just want to keep playing this game. Absolutely, and once we're in like full reveal season and Bandai stop showing us artwork and start showing us cards. Yeah. We'll actually sit down and discuss those like we do with Dragon Ball. Exactly. Yeah. So if you're if you're sub to the PPG Dragon Ball Patreon, we do like card reviews. So like if all the blue spoilers get reviewed, we'll do all the blue spoilers and usually we'll do gameplay too. Um mm-hmm. so we'll do that for one piece too, right? We just gotta wait. Cause you know, we're we're all we're chomping at the bit, right? So everyone thank you uh, for I'll watching. Be- yeah. <laughs> Look at this ball of oh no it's it is it's fixed. It's I fixed, fixed it. it yeah I fixed it. Oh okay yeah he fixed it. That's how much we're chomping at the bit. Yeah I'm up, we're uploading our own cards to the untap. All right everyone thank you for watching and we will be back with more. Peace.